Hello, YouTube. Oh, it's a little pear right there. Get it off. Oh, that's not a pear. That's a... It's... Okay, it's like a lint. Hey, everyone. Thank you guys for joining my YouTube. Like, subscribe, and share. Um, So, I just want to come on and kind of talk to you guys while I work this Saturday. So... Um, how my week's going and things like that. Just want to update you all. Hmm. Hello, Express sending me emails. All right, so those of you that give me a second, y'all, because I'm distracted. All right, so what's new with me? So, this week, I was asked to go home from work because I um, I was asked to go home from work because I refused to take the TB skin test because it's against my religious beliefs. And then they tried to get me to do a chest x-ray, and I, wanted, I didn't want to have unnecessary radiation on my body as well and so i refuse because i have that right right so this was supposedly the first case that has ever done that let me see oh. let's see it has a few jobs um All right, so, yeah. So, Monday, I was at work. I was teaching, vibing with the kids. And sorry, y'all. Trying to apply to a job application. Um, so, yeah, I was vibing with the kids and... They was like, Miss Harkins, you got to go, baby. You got to go. So I'm like, sure, no problem. So I left, and I haven't been working all week. This taught me two things. Well, it taught me a few things. One, jobs will make you sell your soul. Go against anything that you believe in. Go against your core values, your ethics to work for them okay so always keep something else available or in motion because at any point in time they can say hey you gotta go home three always keep some money stacked up i'm talking about stacked up so all you gotta do is pull from it while you wait till you find your next thing That's the three things, really, I learned. And then four, I also learned that I would like to have a second job because, honestly, the living expenses with a degree, a bachelor's degree, is not affordable. So, yeah, basically what I found out. Um, so now I am doing a, a job application so that I can have a part-time job because if I got two jobs, if I have two jobs, I would at least, you know, If I have two jobs, I would at least be able to, like, if one of them is out of work or whatever the case may be, um, 
if something happens to one of my jobs, I'll still have something coming in, right? We spend money every day. So it's important that weekly, monthly, we have some type of checks coming in. And that's the honest reality to everything because without cash, you cannot eat. Without cash, you cannot live comfortably. You won't have shelter. All of your basic needs will not be met if you don't have money. That's in all honesty. And then you have to have enough. You have to have enough to where you're not pinching. Um, you're not penny pinching as well. With um a bachelor's degree is what I'm learning as well. If you don't go into certain things, you won't be making money coming out. I've graduated in 2017, so I've been out of school about four. 2017, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23. I've been out of school six years, and the degree really still, I mean, it's livable, but it's not. Expenses are going to exceed gener generally your income, especially when you're a single person, you're doing everything yourself. So yeah, y'all, I'm applying a job. Hopefully, I give me a second job, and this job is uh helping me get on my feet and get us helping with the many expenses that I have while my business is uh, rising. My income is rising. Speaking of business, if you have not visited my site, please go support the site by visiting my site and ordering some things www.rnrboutique.com All right, I'm going to finish this job application. Hopefully you guys learn some things about having a degree. Um Hopefully this this video was informational. Alrighty, peace out.